Are you interested in adding a forensic science course to your school or district? Well, you are not alone. Anyone who watches TV, goes to the movies, reads newspapers or books, is familiar with forensic science. In recent years, it has become so popular that public perceptions in the criminal justice system have been transformed. The popular television show CSI has been particularly responsible for the unprecedented demand for forensic science, both in schools and the courtroom. Forensic science is a course that connects science, technology, engineering, and math, or STEM. Many schools use it as a capstone course at the junior or senior levels to show students how all of the science and math that they have learned in previous courses is used in the real world. One of the best things about forensic science is that it interests students who are often not interested in typical science courses. It's a great way to inspire students to like science and consider careers in law, criminal justice, or forensic science. Why should you choose Kendall Hunt's Forensic Science for High School? This book provides a truly unique approach to teaching science. The emphasis is on solving problems using forensic science as the medium. The book is hands-on, minds-on. As it teaches the concepts of forensic science, this book engages students in thought-provoking criminal cases and scenarios that require them to take what they've learned and apply it to new situations. It is an inquiry-rich program that contains flexible content and pacing. It provides both teachers and students with digital and print support materials. And it also comes with an online interactive crime scene called Murder at Old Fields that can be used to complement or supplement the course. Let's take a deeper look at each one of these features of forensic science for high school. Forensic science is a natural vehicle for students to practice science as inquiry. This program is an inquiry-rich science course that focuses on the practices, practices and analysis of physical evidence found at crime scenes. For each piece of physical evidence brought in for analysis, the student must apply the scientific method and then be prepared to defend conclusions based on their own empirical evidence. As educators, the main goal is to give students the opportunity to acquire the abilities necessary to do a scientific inquiry. Forensic Science for High School integrates multiple sciences and literacy and science subjects through the following Florida State science domains. Nature of science, physical science, life science, Earth and sci space science, both reading and writing standards for literacy and science, standards for speaking and listening, and English language development. Forensic Science for High School is designed with a variety of teaching options. It can be offered as a one year, a two semester, or a one semester science course. It is even flexible enough that applied chapters can be pulled out to use in other science courses. The writing and content of this text targets grades 11 and 12, but many of the ideas and activities can be adapted to middle school. Forensic science can also be taught with cross-disciplinary approach, teaming with English, social studies, or government courses. You can also connect the course content with criminal justice and sociology or with the studies of law in our judicial system through government courses. This program provides many topics that are of great interest to both teachers and students. There is more content in this book that could possibly be covered in one year, so feel free to pick and choose the topics and activities that seem most appropriate to your circumstances and students. Whether you're teaching this class for a year or a semester, it's recommended that you begin with the first three chapters and then you're free to choose the topics that best suit your objectives. Let's take a look at the content within a chapter. Each chapter begins by presenting background information. It sets the stage for you and your students to begin exploration and investigation into a new topic. The explore, exploratory activities throughout each chapter are used to introduce topics and teach students the skills necessary to complete the lab investigations. Once the students have learned the necessary skills, they complete the lab investigations. The labs provide students with real life investigative experiments that develop ideas for questioning and understanding of the variety of influences that may be present in criminal cases. 
Their purpose is for students to investigate problems and use their skills to develop empirical data that will lead them to supportable conclusions. Labs are in the textbook and the ebook, so no additional yearly purchase of a lab manual are necessary. Students simply keep their lab notes in their notebook. Most chapters have case studies that are true crime stories that the students can read. They're great motivators since they show relevance in what the students are learning. These case studies support the material being learned in the chapter and give the students an opportunity to apply what they have learned to real life cases. Checkpoint questions are provided at the end of each chapter. These can be used as formative assessment to check student understanding. Performance assessments are provided in each chapter as a way for students to use their newly acquired knowledge and skills to answer questions, solve problems or crimes, and to communicate effectively by supporting their conclusions. The expectation is to provide students opportunities to think critically and make connections with real problems. Having students apply this new learning to real life cases helps them develop confidence and internalize their new knowledge. Suggested additional projects can be found at the end of each chapter. These projects let the students investigate either independently or as a class. They can also be used for differentiation to further challenge gifted students or to give additional practice to students who are struggling. For those students who have a high interest in a specific topic, we offer a section with further references and reading. These extra resources can be introduced to students as a place to explore more on their own. They might even inspire some students to consider forensics for a career. These books, articles, films and videos, and websites can also provide teachers with additional background information on the content in the chapter. Kindle Hunt offers great support material to both teachers and students. The teacher's edition is available in print as well as digitally. The digital TE and other digital support materials can be found on our Flourish website. We'll talk a little bit more about that in a minute. The digital resource materials include annotated teacher notes, lesson time charts, assessment resources, activity procedural notes, implementation guide, PowerPoint presentations, and a cohesive assessment system, which is the online test and practice generator. Material kits are also available for this program. It lets teachers spend more time teaching rather than gathering materials. Custom forensic science material kits make creating crime scenes a snap and are available upon request. The student edition is also available in print and digitally. The ebook contains digital bookmarking, highlighting, and note taking tools to support learning. Key terms and margin notes are also provided to further explain concepts. The ebook can be accessed on Flourish along with another excellent support tool called Murder at Old Fields. Murder at Old Fields is an online interactive crime scene that can be used to supplement or complement your text. The crime is based on the 1942 double murder of Alexander and Rebecca Smith at their farmhouse in Old Fields, Long Island, New York. To solve the crime, students examine a 3D crime scene, collect evidence, and conduct virtual labs based on the historical facts of this case. What makes this unique is that there was actually a person tried, convicted, and hung for this murder. The students are tasked with using modern forensic science to decide if they hung the right person. This is a cutting edge tool for teaching forensic science. Students can virtually walk into the house where the crime took place. They can look around, investigate the crime scene, and gather evidence. Once they find the evidence, they examine it, collect it, and log it with a photograph.
from there, they will take it to a virtual lab where they will examine it further and compare it with people of interest. Finally, they will make a conclusion and decide who the evidence belonged to, and they will send it to a teacher to be checked. Flourish is the website where all of the student and teacher digital resources can be accessed, including murder at Old Fields. The website is www.flourishkh.com. If you are interested in taking a look at Forensic Science for High School on Flourish, call 800 542-6657 for a free demo. Forensic science provides a unique opportunity for students to study science that is relevant to their lives. Thank you for taking the time to watch this presentation. For more information on Kendall Hunt's Forensic Science for High School, please call 800-542-6657 or visit our website at www dot k12 dot kindlehunt dot com. Thank you.